This is a definite integration question in which limits of integration are from 0 to pi and the integrand is modulus of cos x dx. Now, how do we decide whether cos x will be positive or negative? So, let us look at the limits of integration. They are from 0 to pi. That means it includes first quadrant as well as second quadrant. Now, in first quadrant, all trigonometric ratios are positive. So, cos x will be, will be positive. And in the second quadrant, cos x is negative. So, let us divide our integration problem into two integrals. First integral is from 0 to pi by 2. And from 0 to pi by 2, since it is first quadrant, cos x will be positive. So, modulus of cos x will open with positive sign. So, this is cos x dx. And from 0 to from pi by 2 to pi, cos x is negative since it is second quadrant and cos x is negative. So, we will write negative sign outside the bracket and this becomes cos x dx. Now, integral of cos x is sin x. So, this becomes sin x and limits of integration are from 0 to pi by 2, then negative sign again sin x, limits of integration are from pi by 2 to pi. Now we will plug in the limits, first we will plug in the upper limit, so this becomes sin pi by 2 and uh, when we apply lower limit this becomes sin 0, negative sin, sin pi minus sin pi by 2. Now value of sin pi by 2 is 1 while sin 0 is 0, then negative sin, value of sin pi is also 0. And sin pi by 2 is 1. So this becomes 1 and minus and minus becomes plus 1 plus 1. So answer is 2.